Good morning, everybody. Porch Light here. And yeah, first, first of all, I kind of want to start out saying thank you for all the new subscribers. You know, uh, shout out to Bushcraft family for uh, that layup. I really appreciate that. You know, and hopefully we will have more um, connection in the future. And it's awesome what you guys are doing over there. So, uh, just real quick, I want to take the opportunity just to show you a real quick Ferry Morris uh, grow light setup. Now, these are my Venus fly traps I got from the Big W, if you all know what that is. And they are doing swimmingly. Now, make sure you're using distilled water for those guys. But all they're going to do is catch flies in the summer. Anywho. So what I'm doing is I'm basically just trying to do a very small uh, situation where I'm getting my seedlings up because I'm planting a lot outside in the greenhouse, as you guys know. So you got some tomato plants here, got some ginger, got some okra coming up. You can see it there. This is a lemon plant that I ordered. I, uh, it should be on one of my other videos, but it's doing real good in the window, so I may just leave it here until it gets hot. And then I got some grocery store basil. And usually these guys don't do well because, you know, there's probably a lot of fertilizing stuff in there. And once it goes through that, they pretty much die out unless you take care of it. And then I got a little, a little, you know, plant here that's not really doing too well. And this is where the magic happens, okay? So, I bought these off of the Big A, if you know what that is. And, you know, they're on other sites too, but they're just little greenhouses. You know, set up with a USB. And bam! I got my okra, got my cucumbers coming up. And I finally started getting some something coming up on the pepper side of it. And, oh, they are taking so long. Ugh, I feel so behind. But... What I want to do, and there's literally nothing in there, but um, I kind of redid that one. But basically, what I'm trying to do is have a situation where I'm not buying any more starts. Now, it's not probably not going to be realistic because, you know, when you're in the store, you see a beautiful plant, you're going to get it. And you got to go to a nursery at some point during uh, the garden season. I mean, that's just a rite of passage, if you know what I mean. But the problem is they're charging too much, y'all. And when you can just put, find a spare room, a uh, spare space where you can just kind of lay stuff out, get your heating mat, got a heating mat here, and just grow some stuff, you know? I mean, it's just time at that point. And then you got a bunch of stuff that's going to pop up anyway. I think the key to this is just make sure you're constantly planting and you are constantly dropping seeds. And if you got some seeds in the... Uh, and you see things that, you know, you, you know, they might not even be good anymore. You know, you just want to get rid of them, cycle them out. Or, you know, it's just, just something that's not really big on your radar. Drop them. See what they do. Get some newer versions of those seeds from whatever they grow from. And do it that way. So, this is all I got today, y'all. Just wanted to show y'all my little setup. And whatever you got going on, just grow something. Okay, and if you grow if you're growing outside you're in a nice climate, it's okay. Grow something inside just to kind of have a backup. Because some of these tomato plants, like this guy here, even though it looks kind of crazy, I got it from another tomato plant, just stuck it in there and it just started growing. So that's the great part about tomatoes and, and so forth. And I think we may actually do something with jewels and artichokes. So more to that, I'm, uh, that's an experiment, but we'll, we'll see how that turns out. But look, y'all, keep growing. Thank y'all for the new subscribers that came on. And look, I've been doing this for four years on this channel. And it's about time that we start reaching some more folks over here. So get this to you, to all your relatives and all the people that need to hear it, y'all. That's all I ask. Well, talk long enough. Porch laid out.